Forget the intro, y'all. Forget the intro. This is this is the biggest fight uh, of our generation, y'all. This is Errol Spence versus Terrence Crawford, y'all. Um. Okay, y'all already probably seen the press conferences. It's lit already. It's lit times 1,000, 9,000, 10,000, the 3,000, 2,000, 1,500, 8,000. 300. It's times all that, bro. Like, all that put together, bro. You put all that together. Okay, if y'all could do something for me real quick, do the math on every number I said, and then, you know, times that by, like, each other and see what it get. That's how much times, like, awesomeness it is. Bro, you guys, honestly, I've been thinking about this fight for so long. I, I genuinely, I really don't know exactly like who is going to win i do not know i'm gonna and i'm telling you guys early that's like an early prediction right now like i have no clue who is gonna win but i will say i do want someone to win and it's like i don't even want to say it like that bro i really do like both of them like you know Aaron, Aero, I said Aaron. Errol Spence is like, he's really a dog. Like, he's a beast. Like, he, he really breaks opponents' wills, break them down, beat them up. He beats fighters up. Like, it's it's one thing to box him, but he really beats fighters up. Like, you seen what he did to your, de your Dennis Ugas. He beat him up, beat him down, battered him, broke him as a man. Like, to do that, to break another man, like, that's crazy. And, but we've seen... Uh, Bud Crawford, we do. We seen uh, uh, Terrence Crawford do that too. We seen him break many men, like break them down, break their face, just break them, bro. Like they both beat fighters up. They fight. They don't just box. They fight. They really beat fighters up, and at, they do at the highest level. And that's what makes it so hard, man. But I guess one thing you could say is like you could lean towards Arrow a little bit because. He's a little younger, I, I'm, if I'm correct. Terrence, yeah, Terrence Crawford's 35. Errol Spence is 33. So, it's a slight age difference. So, they're they're around the same age, but 33, 35. So, Errol Spence has the, a little bit of youth on him. Um, Errol Spence is bigger. Uh, I'm pretty sure Errol Spence is like 5'9". But he naturally walks around at a much bigger weight than... Than um, Terrence Crawford, because Terrence Crawford is like 5'8", I'm pretty sure, but he don't walk at a, at a heavy weight, like, not heavy weight, but like a heavier weight like Errol Spence does, so Errol Spence got the, the little bit of youth on him, he got the size on him, the strength on him, so, but they, but one thing that they got on each other, the one thing that they got locked to each other, they got that dog in them, they got that dog in them, man. I think uh, it's just going to see who, who's going who gonna to break. Who's going to break first? Like, who is going to make the other fighter not want to fight no more? And that's what's going to come down to. Who's going to make the other fighter not want to fight no more? It's that simple. I genuinely don't believe none of them. I don't think any, either one of them going to get knocked out. Um, I do believe it could get stopped, though. Like, someone could get... I don't even think someone could get... Nah. I feel like... Someone probably might get dropped. It's a possibility, but I feel like if anything, it's going to end in stoppage. So, I'm thinking, like, if I had to make a prediction, if I had to choose, I'm going to go with Errol Spence because that's my dog. He from Dallas. Uh, you already know how I feel about Dallas. I love Dallas. Dallas Cowboys. He fought at at and Stadium. I'm rocking with Errol Spence for sure. I love Terrence Crawford, though. He's just a good dude, humble dude. Very cool, man. And he beats people up, bro, just like Errol Spence. And But one thing I will say, I feel like Terrence Crawford's more skilled, but I feel like Errol Spence got that strength to him, the, the size. You know, I feel like it's going to be, it's going to cause problems. And I got Errol Spence winning 11th round TKO. Ref gonna have to get in there and stop the fight. Errol Spence is gonna be crowned undisputed world champion. You feel me? He's gonna be undisputed, bro. It's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be a. It's gonna be a movie, bro. It's gonna be amazing. 
y'all y'all make sure y'all buy the pay-per-view it's at least gonna be a hundred dollar pay-per-view i can bank on that it's gonna be a hundred dollar it has to be bro it's the biggest fight of the decade has to be a hundred dollar pay-per-view but y'all let me know if y'all think gonna win in the comments bro honestly i i it could go either way bro honestly i'm going with errol spence like but i, I would not be mad if terence crawford won won because i i really do love me some terence crawford as well but it's been your boys here the prince y'all let me know y'all predictions i'll see y'all in the next one peace